All right, guys, this is what $1.2 million gets you in horse country. We've got half of the backyard here. There's a big waterfall that's covered behind those trees and a pond. This is a 40, over 48,000 square foot lot. The house needs some significant rehab. Here we are walking towards the side of the property around this big brush that needs to be removed. We've got a nice horse at the neighboring property to the right. This whole area is zoned agricultural, which means it has a lot of uses. Right back over here is a tiki hut, and a row of areca palms that need to be removed. Here's the gate to the back half of the property. As you can see, there's a barn that sustained a little bit of fire damage over here where they used to keep all the stuff for the horse. Over here, I'm peeking over to the neighboring lot, appreciating the size and how quiet this neighborhood is. Here's the horse in the corral. Just real peaceful. If you're looking for a lot of land and don't wanna drive all the way down south to Homestead, horse country may be the place for you. Here we are in the front of the property. There used to be a koi pond right there in the front. And I'm gonna pan over here to the right so you can see these quiet line streets rustic old vintage truck this is right in the heart of miami just 10 to 15 minutes from the airport depending on traffic here we are that's the old chevy and as you can see you've got some really nice large homes you can build up to about an 8,000 square foot home on these acre plus lots over here to the right you see there's a larger lot that is in a nursery. As you can see, some of the properties here are still nurseries farms and this whole area is agriculturally zoned all the lots are at least one acre in size you can still hear the birds chirping during the middle of the day on a saturday here in miami just 15 minutes away from the airport you've got a very private large quiet neighborhood looking to live somewhere where you've got plenty of room between you and your neighbors, don't hear traffic, and are close to the core, horse country might be a great option for you. All right, for those of you stuck around this long, we are going to do a comparative market analysis here on horse country. Horse country is this little section here from Sunset Drive, which is Southwest 72nd Street, all the way up to Bird Road, which is Southwest 42nd Street, comes here from the Florida Turnpike all the way down to 127th Avenue. These are all large acre lots. As you can see, there are 14 properties that have uh, come up in our analysis here. This is a small section where all the lots are at least an acre in size. As you can see here on the right, we've got the smallest lot on sale. Uh, actually, the close was this one right here that had 47,000 square feet and the largest one that's available is basically five acres at 2,000, I'm sorry, 200,000 square feet. They're asking $8 million for this. Let's take a look at this one. This is this beautiful estate we have here. Gorgeous. All right, that one is on 122nd Avenue and 51st Street. And the least expensive one is here on 123rd and 47th Street. It's here for 1.4. All right.
This one's been on the market for 64 days. This one is a little, uh, something strange going on about this one. It, at least it's showing active here, but in reaching out to that broker, uh, she did not respond uh, regarding that particular property. So um, here we are, you can see the least expensive one moved for 1.1. And it was a total teardown. It was just over 115. It closed at 11 just recently. This is right on 122nd Avenue. This is really close to Aguacate, the Sanctuary of Love, uh, which is the vegan juice bar that we are going to feature coming up soon. But as you can see, this is pretty much a teardown in this area. Again, here we've got about a 2,700 square foot home on a 53,000 square foot lot. This moved for $375 a square foot. And the most expensive one that has moved is a 5.5 that moved here for 3.2. It's a 68,000 square foot home. Little dated, not completely modern but a lovely home. Let's see when this one closed. This was on the market for 185 days and this closed way earlier this year. This closed back on April 27th of 2022. Again, this area is agriculturally zoned and they are saying it's an income producing lot because it has fruit trees and zonings that allows horses and livestock giving residents agricultural and equestrian access on the property this is absolutely true this is one of the reasons that drew us to this particular property and uh, we'll be sharing a lot more with you in the future as the uh, upgrades on the property occur if we want to get to this blended average rate here it is let's do this comparables let's finish this off Let's view the CMA so we can get you data. Here's our analysis of the actives with an average price of 4.7. The close has an average of 1.8 and the one that's pending sale is a $2 million piece on 122nd Avenue. So as you can see, we've got an average price per square foot at seven, a blended rate of 737 per square foot with your median home being 2.6, your high end being eight, your low end being 1.1. If you have any questions or would like to do a deal or you're interested in the property that we have on 123rd Avenue and 46th Street, uh, give us a message, shoot me an email, and I'm happy to get you guys uh, some more details on doing a deal here in horse country. Thanks again for watching and don't forget to move Miami.